hey hey what's going on redneck mega man all up in your face in case you didn't know there you go i'm gonna answer something real quick i, I had a quick little uh you know inquiry about how to deal with awkward moments and just just what they are so i just want real quick like you know first off i'm gonna I'm gonna start with being stuck on an elevator. You got the, you got that one person that just wants to talk your head off. You you only going like one floor, but they still want to have a full on combo. Here's what you do: as soon as you get in an elevator where there's one person, five people, or twenty, whatever, you find the nearest corner. You just stand in it like you got in trouble in school. People will not talk. I guarantee you, I've done it before, and uh, you know it works really great. So, uh, here's another thing, too. When, when you see people picking their nose, don't look away and act like you don't see it. Encourage them. Sometimes you get them good old raunchy, crusty ones get all up in the brain. You need, some, you need some moral support. So what you do is you just tell them, like, hey, pick me a winner, man. <laughs> don't stop now. Come on now. Mine for gold. We'll get gold rush going on. Just, just tell them something like that. They need to hear it. It'll, it'll get them doing it quicker too. Here's another thing too. PDA, public display of affectionaries. You know, why you got? It's like boogers. Don't look away. They're giving you a free show. Just grab a beer, get a popcorn, lay down on the lawn, have you a little picnic, or you could entrepreneur it and start a line. Get people to, you know, line up behind you. Just start charging the cover. Why why have I got to think of all these great ideas? Here's here's another thing, too. Farting. Sometimes you just got to do it. Hey, I mean, it, you'll implode. It's a science fact. Look it up. It's worth Google. But you got to do it. So if you're going to do it, just time it perfect. Right when that door slams. You know, that's a little late right there. Just, you know, you got to time it just right. Practice makes perfect. You do it in your home. You go out. You can time it just at the right moment. If people smell it, that's that's a whole other issue. I mean, you let Sherlock Holmes deal with that and find out who did it. Here's another thing, too. I got two more things. You got people talking in the bathroom? Hey, always go for the toilet. Don't go for the stand-up stall. Well, you got to pay or, or whatever. Just go in there and just describe everything going on in there out loud. Just say it out loud. That way, you know, whenever you get to the sink, people were avoiding you like, like the Browns at the Super Bowl. Uh, and last thing, awkward silence. Don't make it awkward. I like awkward silence. I, one time I, I didn't talk for six months straight. I think it was in a monastery in Dothan or Duluth, Alabama or something. But yeah, I didn't talk for six months straight. Uh, I think it might have been mono. Awkward silence, just start a running count. Just, you know, as soon as it starts. And then whenever someone starts talking, just say, oh, man, you ruined it. Come on now. That was a fun little game. That's it. How to deal with awkward moments. Bogatis.